Welcome back. Hello. It's Gohan. Okay. Come along. I got what? your player head. Why did you take my head? I didn't know you left there on purpose. <laughs> you just saw my head and was like, it's a sign. <laughs> well, you have all your other heads laid out, so I thought maybe... Okay, sure, let's take one. it. Hello, Bobla. Yeah, we did it. 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 Yeah, we did it. it. I don't know. What are we doing, Bubbler? What's the plan? I do not know. You do not know. How do you not know? I what? just know. Hey, oh. I will sort these chests soon, don't worry. Just not right now. Okay. I think uh, another thing that we need to work out to do after we do the zoo is we need to get a wither, because we need a beacon. Yeah. That's another thing we need to do. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I'm a little bit disoriented and don't really know what to do. <laughs> you have any thoughts? Mm. Mm, head and be only fought ankle hurty. I'm sorry your ankle hurts. Do you want the, the do you want the LAs to go in? No. They will. You'll go in. I know. What what you do here? Follow you. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing here. Where are we going? Why are we in the nether? Why not? <gasps> ah! Okay. Danger. Danger. Sinsonite. Where do you get never fucking reads from? I've been seeing recipes involving never reads fucking ever. Where are they? Where are they? I do not know. Not good enough. I need to know. Where are they at? 
You know. I do not know where they are. But you know. I don't know. I'm telling you to know. What you doing? I don't know. Thinking. Thinking. What you thinking about? I don't know. Why do you sound sad? Because you're clearly not wanting to play and you're tired and sleepy. No. Well. Are we back home? No. Oh. I'm looking for something. Reeds? Yeah. How could you tell? Just to walk, I guess. What would you do if I hit the home lever? Uh, I don't know. And then the D mat remat. Oh, look at you! You've learned how to fly the TARDIS. Well, I would be in a bit of a pickle. Um. You know, I'd probably find my way home eventually, because I could just... I mean, it would take a while, but I could find the netherboard where I have the coordinates. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. But I don't think that you're the abandoning type. <coughs> Lucky you. I would never have blambled in the movie. You would never have bamble him? Oh, I need yeah. attacked. By what? Hellhounds. Ooh! Oh my god, what the hell is going on? There is explosion of them. Bad things, and where are you at? I don't know. I'm in the TARDIS. Yeah, I know. I've kind of lost it. <laughs> lost TARDIS. You say um, it like it's not like a tiny thing in a big I know, old but still. world. Uh, the location, according to the scanner, is 480, 36, <laughs> 156. Okay. Okay, so straight that way. Thank you. So 480, 136. There it is. Hello. Oh, yeah. Hello.
What are you doing? I'm trying to land. He doesn't want to. Oh, no, it definitely took off. Landing obstructed, for fuck's sake. There we go. Where are we at now? Still in the nether. Still looking for... TARDIS is floating. Okay, I found some interesting looking things, but nothing that I... Wanted. Okay. How do I get back in the TARDIS? Build up to it, I guess. Bit floating. Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> That was not the right biome. I like that you're not coming out for even one of these journeys. <laughs> well, it's scurry. It's not scurry. It's not scurry. It's barely even scurry. Why do you find it scurry? Because it's scurry. You cannot see the outside before you walk into it. Oh my god. I've landed in pretty much... No, no, the exact same place. What the fuck, TARDIS? <laughs> Hi. Hi. Fine, take us home. Well, I don't know how to take us home. You you do. <laughs> Look at you go. <laughs> and then when the wheezing stops. All right, there we go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> How? <laughs> We're underneath our house. <laughs> Face it. Just press the button again, home, and then boop. boop. <laughs> God. Your first try, and you landed on the ground. <laughs> It's not my fault. Huh. I think this thing is not quite worth the trouble. <laughs> okay, home. I'm gonna set it 20 blocks offset, go. Nailed it. <laughs> this is fucking stupid. <laughs> uh, hello, Bobla. Hello. What's the plan? 
I don't know. What is the plan? I don't know. I want to do something exciting. What exciting is there to do? That's a good question. Eh? This thing doesn't have a soul. Yeah. Good I've got a stick that peers into the soul of whatever you click on. Oh, where did you get that from? I made it out of an orange on a stick. For instance, you are Pipe Saka. Who would have thought? Let me see it. Look. <laughs> Do I whack you with it? Right click. Take 1000. Okay. Horse. <laughs> it's very detailed. <laughs> oh. I don't want to be a chicken. Duck. I don't even want to be a duck. What is the point of this stick? I don't know. I made it though. You're welcome. Very cool. I have a loot. I'll put it in your kit. Sort chest. That's not the solution to all your problems, you know. It's the solution to all of is... my problems. Mm, nah. Mm, yeah. Mm, nah. Onion. Why did you do that? <laughs> it's not funny. It's kind of funny. It's not funny. It's a little bit Fonty. He's not Fonty. He's Fonty. He's not. Okay, okay. Are you a coconut? Or are you a just coconut. a lobster? Not a lobster. You can make sconces. Suppose so. Why do you say that? Like, what? I don't know. I suppose so. Suppose so. Suppose so. Alright. Let's make some of these glorified torches, shall we? Ooh, we get fancy in here. Fancy? Fancy schmancy? Fancy schmancy. Ooh, wee. Ooh, ooh. Look at this. Hell yeah. It's a sconce. My response to your sconce is. Bob Oh. Huh? Gone trees, gone trees. All right, what else can we do? <laughs> Ooh, wee, wee. Wrecked 
Bubbler. Yeah. How are you? Uh I'm uh, okay. Uh stuck on a feeling. I don't believe it. I dig it. Is there only three songs it can play? <laughs> yes, is the answer to that question. <laughs> Should we be able to give these to a lay so they can just constantly play them? Oh, the tree's yep. awake. Hey, tree. I met a dolphin once. Funny fellow. Can read the rest. Those were the days. Okay. Okay. Reaper. Do you craft do you craft mine or mine to craft? I mine to craft, I think is the answer. Yeah. yeah. <coughs> no lollygagging. I will do what I wish. Today's mighty oak is yes yesterday's nut that he something. I see. I right, went too fast, and the and the uh, captains were blocking it. So, why is the recipe for soap so weird? What now? Why is the recipe for soap so weird? Mm -hmm. A bucket of water, four ash, and a pork chop. Yeah, it's really weird. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Neither do I. I really want a platypus. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking hell. <laughs> How have we not found this guy yet? What guys? Baphomet. <laughs> Maybe it's something that we have to. I really want you to get into doing the witch shit because I don't want to do it. But you don't want to do it either. Ow! Ow! I'm being assaulted! You're gonna get him? Yeah. Kinda deserve it. Do I? Do I, I deserve this? <laughs> I don't want to hurt him. <laughs> I 
<laughs> he's like, okay. Okay, he's on. <laughs> He was just chilling in the music. <laughs> he's like, okay, this is fine. Okay, I think he's chilled out. Oh no, he has not. He has not. Okay, he's not. Oh god, he is violent. Menacing. <laughs> just leave the house! He's gonna be aggro when I get back. Okay. I'm kind of tired of being you anyway. Why? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Why are you tired of being me? Because <laughs> it's weird. I'm the... tired of being. Okay. Who are you now? I haven't regenerated yet. Oh. I'm changing the option to a different one. Let's do... <coughs> Let's do sneeze. That's the quickest. Is the, is the little guy friendly yet? I don't know. He seems to be. Hey buddy. Is this one example as to why you shouldn't throw eggs. Um, one and only. No, because otherwise, otherwise it wastes eggs. It's temporarily messy. It's just not good. It's very traumatic. And it makes tons of more chickens over time. Tons. Under it's a little bit of an overstatement, don't you think? No. I haven't seen a chicken in days. I have. You literally threw an egg at me in the house earlier, I think in the last episode or two, and made a chicken. That's not true. It is true. Leonardo. Da Vinci. Leonardo da Vinci. Where are you at? By the never portal. Make it purple. What's your power? Uh, arrow damage negated. Mm. However, I'm currently kind of blind. It's phasing in and out. doing? <laughs> fucking around. Fucking around, fucking around. Fucking around, fucking around. Oh. Fucking around and not finding out. Hmm. What would happen if we found out? I don't, I don't even know. It's Probably go viral. Okay. Maybe we should find out. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I love when this happens. It's my favorite part of this mod. The, the random yeah. damage segment. Oh, shit, you can make an advent calendar? Dope. That's cool. You need spirit, though. Where do you get spirit from? Where do you get half the shit from the Noel mod? 
I'm not sure. Mr. Sandman, bring me a dream. Make him the cutest that I've ever seen. Give him two lips like roses and clover. I'm gonna look it up. And tell him that his lonesome nights are over. Mr. Sandman, I'm so alone. I ain't got nobody to call my own. Please and down your magic beam. Mr. Sandman, bring me a dream. Sonne de matina, sonne de matina, ding de dong, ding de dong. Am I gonna have to watch a fucking YouTube video to work out how to trigger Christmas? And don't tell okay. me it has to be fucking crema. You see, it tells by the calendar on your computer that it is Christmas time. What is Christmas? Um, oh, shit. Yeah, but how do you make it if you need spirit to make it? That makes no fucking sense. In it. Damn it, though. I'm so fucking confused. It's Christmas. You know what Mexican candy I wish was vegan, like really bad? What? Duvaline. I don't know what that is. It's like a chocolatey. Well, it comes in multiple flavors. I think strawberry is maybe one of them, but it's usually a, a pack that has two different flavors, like chocolate and vanilla, or like hazelnut and vanilla, or chocolate and hazelnut. I don't know. Maybe strawberry one. I, can't, I seem to remember there's a pink one. Uh, and it comes with a little spoon, and it's just a little spread, and you just eat it with a spoon, and it's really good. Okay. Well, I wish that you had it, and it was vegan. I wish it was vegan. If it was vegan, it wouldn't be too hard to get, but it's not vegan, so it is impossible to get. Well... Unless I were to make it homemade, which I don't want to make homemade duvaline. Duvaline. This is uh, like your spoon. What? Hello? Hello? Hi. 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 Christ. Yeah, it comes in strawberry too. I was right, but uh, hazelnut and vanilla, or strawberry and vanilla, or not only strawberry and hazelnut, or the triple um, strawberry, hazelnut, and vanilla, or I think there's one of them that's like a hazelnut, chocolate, strawberry, and vanilla. I don't know. It comes in like multiple combinations of those four or three flavors. Yeah. And I love me some hazelnut. 
I'm not a fan. I love hazelnut. Okay. I could take or leave the actual hazelnut itself, but as far as hazelnut flavored things go, like candies and coffee, I love it. The actual nut is okay, it's just a little bit bitter and the texture's not like 100%, but... Yeah. It's not my favorite nut, but it's a good flavor. But, uh, if anybody likes Duvalin, I think that's how you say it anyway, and you watch this, by the time you watch this, I will have forgotten about it, uh, completely. Uh, I, but I'll probably forget about it by tomorrow, honestly. Um, if you like coffee, and you like Duvalin, and you want to get a Duvalin-like coffee, just order a. Ooh, what is this? You can, you can go to a coffee shop and order like a cafe mocha uh, with hazelnut and vanilla. At least at Starbucks, it tastes very, very similar to a Duvalin in coffee form. That's my. That's my. That's your drink hack yes. today. Well, neat. <laughs> Yes. I for one do not I get like... mine with I don't like hazelnut. I've never liked hazelnut. Um it's ruined. Have you it. it's ruined. Chocolate. You don't like hazelnut flavored things? No. Do you like coffee? Sometimes. <laughs> I wonder if you would like it in coffee. I doubt it. It's like a different profile, because coffee's like, you know, strong bodied. It's not like body. chocolate, rich. Good chocolate, like goat. Yeah. <laughs> but I don't know. Maybe you'd like hazelnut and coffee. I think hazelnut is just so good. I'm glad you think it's good. Especially when mixed with chocolate. La 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 You purple. Make it purple. Oh. oh. I don't know what I'm doing. This has been a weird episode. Coffee though. Weird. Weird. Instead of wheel. Nice. Nearly got you. <laughs> Uh, blah, blah, what do we do? I don't know. It's been a full Do you have any uh, unique food or drink items that you can suggest? I don't know. I don't think anything I eat is particularly weird. I don't say weird, it's unique. Okay. I'll let you just gaslight, gaslight me because I'm that's, that's why you said weird or unique. <laughs> but, okay. Oh, maybe I did say weird. I don't know. I just don't remember <laughs> saying weird. Stop throwing eggs. How about no? How about yes? Um, do you think anything that I eat is unique? I don't know. It could be like a food combination. It could be a food that you eat because you, or a drink that you drink because you miss another food or drink that you can't have anymore. I don't really drink a whole lot. That's, that's the drink problem. Okay, then food. Goodness. 
I've eaten raisins with a piece of chocolate because I can't find chocolate raisins that are vegan. It's the yeah. closest that I can get to having chocolate raisins is having a piece of vegan chocolate and then a handful of raisins and then just combo. <laughs> Like is there the... any type of chocolate that you have with the raisins that most closely resembles the ra the chocolate covering chocolate raisins? I mean, the one that I currently have, which I haven't finished, um, I think you would like the chocolate a lot, because I didn't realize when I bought it, it's a hazelnut chocolate. It tastes like Nutella. Yeah. So that one's not my favorite. Um, I don't know. Um, I really like the lint I think it's lint. Is it lint? I or lindent? So. I don't know. <laughs> um, their chocolate bar that they do, the plain chocolate vegan bar that they do, is really good with it. Um, so good. <laughs> um, yeah. Chocolate raisins um, should be easy to make vegan. When you... Someone do it. Yeah. Somebody really needs to make vegan candy corn, and I know that that's kind of, that's like a controversial candy. I think, but it would be easy. I, I think you'd have it already if it was a British candy, but we've never had it here, so we're not trying to make it. <laughs> so... I miss candy corn, especially the little candy corn pumpkins. They're so good. What is a candy corn? Isn't it just fondant with a glaze? I have no idea, but it's good. Let me look it up. It's candy corn. Candy corn is a small pyramid shaped candy, typically divided into three colors, um, with a waxy texture and a flavor based on honey, sugar, butter, and vanilla. I don't know what it's made out of there. Uh, sugar corn syrup, confectioner's glaze. Or shellac, which is the part that makes it not vegan, right? Yeah. That, or sometimes I've seen ones with, like, beeswax. Gelatin, sometimes. Uh, and gelatin, sometimes. Being attacked. Uh, huh? I'm being attacked. Oh. Uh, by what? A zombie. But, um, have, when you were little... Yeah. Uh... Did you ever read or have a book read to you called Chrysanthemum about a mouse? I did not. Okay, um, I'm gonna look it up to make sure that's what it's called. I can't remember if that's what the book was called or if that's just what the mouse's name was called. Okay. Yeah, it's a book called Chrysanthemum. And... It was about a young mouse who loves her unique name until she is teased about it by her classmates. Uh, right. And like they ridicule her for being named after a flower and say that her name is so long it doesn't it barely fits on her name tag. Um, but the only thing I remember about chrysanthemum, other than it was a mouse named Chrysanthemum, who got made fun of for her name, is that we read it in class whenever I was really little, and one of Chrysanthemum's favorite foods was macaroni with ketchup. Yes. Uh, and everybody in my class, because they were little kids, and somebody started it, so obviously other people were going to chime in, and it's going to become a group thing. So they're going, ew, and like laughing. Cause they were like, oh, that's so gross, macaroni with ketchup. Uh, and then I was like one of the kids in the, who was sitting in there like all quiet because I was like, oh, but I like ketchup on macaroni. Um, because yeah. like, you, you can have cheese and ketchup or cheese and tomato-based products on many other foods, whether that's pasta or like pizza or like other Foods. I don't. I don't know what foods have tomato-based products and cheese products. But it's not a weird combination at all. It's not a weird flavor combination <laughs> at all. 
but I just I have this memory of everybody being like, "Ooh, gross," talking about chrysanthemums' favorite food, and me being like, "But I like that." Uh, and like as an adult, I don't really have ketchup on macaroni when I have macaroni anymore that often. But sometimes I'll still put a little bit of ketchup on a little bit of the macaroni, and I'll be like, "Yes, this is childhood." Mm-hmm. Hello. Hello. Okay. I don't know why I can remember such random things like the chrysanthemum thing, but I can't remember integral memories. Oh, that was yeah, that was her favorite dinner. Uh, macaroni and cheese with ketchup. I mean, I used to, whenever I went to McDonald's, I would have, like, fries. Or, like, when I was a child, I would have nuggies, and I would have it with a um, what's it called? A McFlurry, and then I've dip dip my food into it. Because yeah. it's a good combo. It's things, just because something's considered weird, doesn't mean it's bad. Mm. Ooga booga. Anyway, this has been a long episode where we've done nothing because I don't know. So thank you. Talk a lot. We've talked a lot. This has been the podcast episode. That's what we'll call it. Thank you for yes. watching this episode of whatever this is. We'll see, see you next ya. time.